Probably science and technology are some of the indispensable gifts that society had received. Through the application of his knowledge, man was able to produce different technologies that help his society where he belongs to make their lives more convenient. Science and technology revolutionized the life of man. It was vastly ameliorated because of the continuous advancement of science and technology. Transportation, healthcare, workforce, food and agriculture, education, and communication are some of the sectors of society that were vastly lifted by science and technology. Mabuhay! Greetings from Magalang, Pampanga, Philippines. I am Christian Ramos Basilio, a public school teacher from the school's division, Office of Pampanga, also a Doctor of Philosophy in Science Education student at the Graduate School of Nevaecia University of Science and Technology. And I am your presenter for this learning session. For this learning session, our discussion in the subject Evolution and Advances in Science and Technology under the supervision of Mr. Mario Maliari Abisamis is all about the relationship and similarities of science and technology. Specifically, our learning targets for this learning session are the following. First, define science and technology. And second, identify the relationship and similarities between science and technology. To begin our discussion, let us understand what is science and what is technology. The term science comes from the Latin word scientia meaning knowledge. Therefore, we can say that science is knowledge. But the question here is, what kind of knowledge is science? Science is the knowledge about the natural world gained through observations and experimentations. The main goal of science is discovery. It is a systematic and logical approach to discovering how things in the universe work. It is a methodical and rational approach to exploring our natural world. To remember it easily, science is the systematic and comprehensive investigation and exploration of nature's causes and effects. Questions like why volcanoes erupt, why people get sick, how plants make their food, why eclipses occur, why global warming occurs, and why can we see things are some of the questions that can be answered and explained by science. Scientists use the scientific method in investigating our natural world. A scientific method is a problem-solving approach used by scientists in answering questions about the world around us. The scientific method consists of different steps which include making an observation, asking a question, formulating a hypothesis, testing the hypothesis through experimentation, recording and analyzing the results, drawing a conclusion, and communicating the results. Different scientists use different steps in the scientific method. However, they use the same core approach to find answers that are logical and supported by evidence. The continuous investigation and research in science results in the advancement of scientific knowledge and scientific discovery. This leaves room for question for further investigation. As mentioned earlier, science is a system of obtaining knowledge to explain natural phenomena through experimentation and observation. When this knowledge is put into practice to solve human needs or problem, this is called technology. The word technology is from the Greek technologia, which means systematic treatment of an art, craft, or technique. Technology refers to the process of applying scientific knowledge in practical applications for various purposes. It exists to invent ways to solve problems or improve efficiency and effectiveness. 
Technology is a combination of technique, skills, processes, design, and products which is dedicated to creating instruments or gadgets or to complete scientific investigation. It is a set of knowledge that has practical application in the creation, designing, and utilization of products for industrial, commercial, or everyday use. We are surrounded by things that are created with the help of certain technology, whether we work, communicate, travel, manufacture, secure data, business, and almost everywhere. Most people use technology to simplify their work and also to extend their abilities. It also ensures a solution to various scientific problems. Based on the definitions presented, we can say that science and technology are always together. They come hand in hand. Science is all about knowing, and technology is all about doing. After designing what is science and what is technology, let us now decipher our next learning target, which is to identify the relationship and similarities between science and technology. First, both science and technology revolve around knowledge and facts. Science is all about the acquisition of knowledge and facts about the natural world. The development of a certain technology is dependent on existing knowledge and facts about the natural world. Inventors use knowledge and facts to develop different forms of technology. For example, Hans Lieberche used scientific knowledge of the properties of light and lenses to design his telescope. Second, both science and technology help each other advance. The goal of science is to answer questions and increase knowledge. Meanwhile, the goal of technology is to find solutions to practical problems. Although they have different goals, science and technology work hand in hand and each helps the other advance. The technology uses science to solve problems and science uses technology to make new discoveries. Let us analyze the case of a seismometer. A seismometer is a device that senses and records ground movements caused by earthquakes. The invention of the seismometer depended on scientific knowledge of waves and motion. Using seismometer, scientists discovered that Earth has a solid inner core. In this case, scientific knowledge is used to create new technologies. New technologies often allow scientists to explore nature in new ways. Third, both science and technology contribute to the improvement of our society. Science and technology have had a major impact on society and their impact is growing. Both science and technology revolutionized the way we live. It drastically improved our means of communication, the way we work, our housing, clothes, food, our methods of transportation, and indeed, even the length and quality of life itself. Both science and technology require specific skills to excel. Academic, experimental, analytical, and logical skills are required for science. Meanwhile, planning, design, developing, problem-solving, decision-making, and interpersonal skills are required for technology. For both science and technology are changing over time. The type of science and technology that we have 1,000 years before is vastly different from the science and technology that we have in the present time. Our scientific knowledge continuously changes and evolves over time. Some of the misconceptions that we have before are now corrected because of new scientific observations and of course, because of the invention and improvement of new and existing technological tools. However, it is important to know that technology changes faster than scientific knowledge. And fifth, 
both science and technology stand upon the shoulders of giants. Scientists and inventors of today build on the knowledge and discoveries made by others. It might be that they continue and grow the work of the scientists or inventors who have mentored and supervised them or that they build on prior discoveries, both recent and historical. The scientific knowledge and technological tools that we have right now are somehow based on the scientific knowledge and technological tools that we have in the past. Indeed, science and technology are related to each other. Although they have differences, both science and technology are similar in one thing, and that is to understand our world even better, which is a key ingredient in improving the quality of our lives in general. And that ends my discussion about the relationship and similarities between science and technology. Thank you for listening. Dakalpong salamat, luwit kayo.